Today we are going to be testing some pulverized ore that came in. This material has already been crushed to a fine powder and it contains gold. We don't know any more information about this stuff except that it was mined by somebody by hand, pulverized but not tabled. tabled. So today we're going to do an analysis to ensure what we have is 10 pounds of ore and that what we have will yield a decent tonnage. The next step we have taken is we have washed down the entire table and made sure there's no residual junk on it because any contamination will seriously mess us up. So we want to make sure that we're absolutely clear and clean that way we don't have any kind of uh, contaminants getting into the table. We've also taken our dirt and wetted it down. We're going to let it soak, make sure those air bubbles start. Then using clean gloves, we're going to swish it by hand just so there's no gold on me to get in there. Because we want to make this as accurate as a test as possible. And then we're going to run it on the table and see what we get. We have now concentrated it down as a very oxide laden ore. All the sand in there is black, which means it's oxidized and there's free milling gold. Uh, the nice thing is there's quite the line of free milling gold in there, particularly that it's from only 10 pounds of material. We don't want it to float away. That's a pretty telling sign when there's that much free gold. So, next we're going to capture it, dry it, weigh it, and see what we get. That's what we got out of 10 pounds. Not bad. Now it's time to weigh it up. 